children, our topic for today is proper nouns. So before proceeding with proper nouns, let us all recall what are common nouns. Common nouns refer to the general names of persons, places, animals and things. Similarly, proper nouns refer to the specific names or you can see the special names of persons, places, animals or things. Okay, so today I will be teaching you proper nouns in the form of a story. So listen carefully to know what are proper nouns. Let's get started. Once there lived a boy whose name was John. He had a sister named Mickey. Okay, so as you know boy and sister both refer to which noun? Common nouns. So every common noun has a special name too. Every general name or you see common noun has a special name. And those special names refer to proper nouns. So boy and sister is a common noun here. And what is the special name given to the boy? It is John. So John here is a proper noun. And what is the special name given to his sister? It is Mickey. So Mickey and John are the proper nouns here. They had a pet dog named Fluffy. So as we know dog also is a common name given to all the dogs. So the special name for this dog, for the pet dog of who? John and Mickey is Fluffy. So Fluffy here is the proper noun. They lived with their parents in an apartment called Eco Stay Apartment. And it is in Mumbai. So the eco stay apartment here is a proper noun. Because it is the special name of the apartment. And where do they live? They live in a city named Mumbai. Mumbai is a special name of the city. As we have learned earlier that city is a common noun. So Mumbai is a special name which is the proper noun of the city. The apartment is in Abbey Road. In which road is the apartment? The roads are all common nouns. Okay? So the special name given to this road is Abbey. Abbey Road is a proper noun here. Every evening they go along with Fluffy to Teddy Bear Fun Park. So the park's name here is Teddy Bear Fun Park. So Teddy Bear Fun Park refers to the proper noun because it is the special name of a park. Mickey's birthday was the next day. It was April 27th and it fell on a Sunday. So let me tell you children, all months and the names of the months and the names of days, all come under the category of proper nouns because they are the special names. Month and year or you can say week or day. Month, year, week, day. These are common names or you can say common nouns but the special name for example April 27th is her birthday so April here is the proper noun because it is the special name of the month and it fell on a Sunday. Sunday is the special name of the day. So, Sunday is the proper noun here. This, they celebrated it in a grand way. Mother prepared delicious food and her father gifted her a ladybird cycle. So, ladybird cycle refers to the name of the cycle. It is a special name given to the cycle. So, ladybird cycle is the proper noun here. And John gifted her a storybook on Jataka Tales. So the name of the storybook is Jataka Tales. Okay. So Jataka Tales is also a proper noun. It was a happy day for all of them. So they planned to visit the Mithi River. They wanted to go to the Mithi River for boating. So river is a common noun. But the special name given to the river is Mithi. So Mithi is a proper noun here. While boating, they were amazed or you can say they were surprised to see the beautiful Povai hills around. All around the river was surrounded with hills. 
So, what is the name of the hill? Hill is a common noun, but the name of the hill is Powai. So, Powai is a special name given to the hill and it is a proper noun. So, finally, they returned home happily. Okay, so this is the end of the story. Let me tell you that each and every proper noun begins with a capital letter. Let it be at any place. If it is at the beginning of a sentence, also it begins with a capital letter. If it is in the middle of a sentence, it will also begin with a capital letter. That is the best way to identify a proper noun. Because all proper nouns need to begin with a capital letter. If you write a proper noun with its small letter, in its small letter, it will be wrong. Okay, we should always use capital letters to mention proper nouns. Thank you.